Hey everyone, welcome to Nintendo Prime. My voice is a little shot uh, from PAX and hanging out with friends and having a lot of fun, so apologize if I sound a little bit raspy, but there's a, some things I want to talk about um, because I I love making YouTube content, right? I, I love talking about Tears of the Kingdom. I love talking about Mario and, and all his friends and Luigi and Pikmin, but I also love the community we have here. Um, and, and I think we've had so many new people join this community in the last few months that I wanted to sort of reintroduce myself, as it were. So before I do that, I will remind you all that we are on our road to 100,000 subscribers. And if we do happen to get there by the time Tears of the Kingdom comes out, we'll be giving away a collector's edition of Tears of the Kingdom and one of those Tears of the Kingdom pins you could only get at PAX East. Hi, my real life name is Nathaniel Rumpel Jantz. I am a 36 year old guy, lives in Wisconsin, been talking about Zelda in particular for many, many years. I started fan websites back when I was 12, uh, ended up being editor in chief of a site called Zelda Informer for over a decade. And before that site got bought out and I guess consumed by another fellow website in Zelda Dungeon. I've been on different podcasts. I've wrote for different websites. I've done a little work for th places like Nintendo Everything. Uh, and I, I've made a lot of contacts and, and met a lot of people over the years. I've been to three different E3s. I've been with Gamer Passes and as media. And I obviously do YouTube content now. The, the thing is, in all of this, I'm not like an insider. I think some people feel like because I've had a, a, a few, you know, things sourced to me, the people think I'm some sort of insider. I'm definitely not a Nintendo insider. I don't personally know anyone who currently works at Nintendo. I, I, I can say that right now. I don't, I, I don't really know anyone if, if, if I'm being frank. What I do know, though, is how much I love talking about video games. Uh, at one point in my life, when, when I had uh, the Zelda Informer gig end and, and sort of taken from me, I didn't know what I was going to be doing uh, in this industry anymore, if anything, right? I was working other jobs, and, and that was really true even into last year. But what's interesting as I focus in on being a full-time YouTuber today is I didn't know when I got into YouTube about five years ago six years ago, that I was going to end up loving it the way that I do now. This is, I look forward to this. I wake up looking forward to creating the next big YouTube content, the next big video. And I, I, I know there's been a lot of like rumors and or leaks or stuff like that, you know, on the channel for a bit, but I actually just want to cover a bunch of Nintendo news. The problem is we're not really getting a lot of Nintendo news that I would say is noteworthy. Nintendo's being a bit silent. A lot of that's because they're, they're, they're promoting the Mario movie. And, you know, obviously they'll eventually start the Zelda promotion and then we'll have a lot more to talk about when it comes to actual news. Because, you know, I, I literally can go to a website like MyNintendoNews.com and, you know, when, when some of the biggest headlines, besides the first one, I guess, that came from my channel, uh, well, some of the biggest headlines are like, hey, former Nintendo employees say Smash, you know, Melee HD will never happen. Okay, cool. Um, Lord of the Rings Gollum comes out on Switch later this year. I mean, those are news. And I have some thoughts on Lord of the Rings Gollum because I played it at PAX East. But for the most part, none of it is stories that I feel like my audience is really going to care that much about. If it's not Zelda right now, it's already hard to get people to watch. But uh, e even beyond that, none of these are exciting. These, these aren't the kind of things that get you up in the morning, right? We're not getting a lot of new trailer drops. We're not getting a lot of new interviews and, and details like that. So we're sort of stuck in this limbo where we discuss things. And one of the number one things on my channel, and it, I, I don't know if it's still in my channel banner. If I, I'm going to check right now. Uh, it does not have it in my channel banner anymore. So in former uh, versions of the Nintendo Prime uh, YouTube channel, I used to say, you know, we'd have news, opinions, podcasts, et cetera, et cetera. And a lot of my videos are discussion videos. Uh, I do have some that are actually news. Usually I'll put news in the thumbnail if it's something I consider to be news. Or the headline will be very, very specific that it is news. Uh, 
it gets a little confusing because in the world of social media, you got to do things a certain way. You got to play the game a certain way. But I, I really do stand behind the content of my videos and the things I say inside of them. And I'll, I'll give you an example of a recent discussion video um, where I talked about the champion abilities returning in Tears of the Kingdom. If you watch the video, it's pretty obvious that no, there's no news or anything. I'm just wondering if the champion abilities could come back in Tears of the Kingdom, and I, I, I give some opinions on that. And I love making content about that. I love talking about games. That's why I'm here. And I, I just want you guys to know a bit about me. I'm, I'm a parent of three children. I have a 7- and 9-year-old and a 12-year-old daughter, uh, two sons and a daughter. I'm, you know, love them, love them very much. But what I really love the most about what I do here on YouTube in particular is interactions with the fans, whether it's on live streams, the podcast, comment sections. You know, I, I can be a little wild sometimes. I, uh, I I can be a little defensive because I love what I do and I have my reasons for it. And unfortunately, things get assumed to me at times that aren't true. I have friends here on YouTube with me. Andres Restart, Mike Odyssey. You guys should go subscribe to them as well. Other people, you know, Player Essence and Monster Maze and uh, so many others. It, it, it's insane. Jake Randall. I, I'm i very appreciative of the people I have met through what I do here, and I'm very appreciative of all of you. Honestly, well, I've always sort of in the back of my mind over the years kind of thought, what would it be like to be a full-time YouTuber? Not that I am one, I'm just more thankful than ever. Uh, we, we recently crossed 92,000 subscribers. I don't even... Like that number is, is is astronomical to me. Yeah, I, I don't even know why. Well, why are you watching this video? Like, I, I, don't, I don't know what I did to deserve uh, this sort of attention. But what I do know is... <sighs> you guys are awesome. And I think sometimes we beat ourselves up a lot. And we have our reasons. Maybe, maybe we, we made a bad decision or we said something mean or, or we hurt somebody else or uh, we have a hard time getting out of bed in the morning and we think that you know each of us are, are bad people and, and, and don't deserve to do what we do. I just want you to know how amazing you are and how much of a difference each and every one of you have made in my life. Because um, you know when you're on the internet and you're, and you're creating content and you're talking stuff uh, and you're in front of, of you know, People, there's going to be certain sectors of the internet that just are, they're going to come down on you. Justified, unjustified. It really doesn't matter because it all sort of hits the same. And it's so appreciative that you can just turn around and look at your own community, read your own comment section, watch you guys react in live streams, and just smile because there's 92,000 of you that just really enjoy the, the stuff I'm doing here. Um, it, it helps lift me up uh, and, 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 and makes me just love this job even more. So while this might not be the Zelda video you were hoping for today, or it might not be uh, the, the big news video you're hoping to drop, and I'll probably have some sort of Zelda discussion video later today, I, I just wanted to let you all know that uh, thank you so much for everything you've done for me and my family. Uh, I love you guys, and uh, you know we'll, we'll catch you a bit later. We, we, we do have a live podcast happening today, so... Uh, I'll catch you guys during that, absolutely. Be sure to stop by.